Well, we just don't know yet. Simple as that. We don't know. The count in the Electoral College is uh, Biden 238, Trump 213. Got to get to 270 to win. Still a path for the president, but he's got to win most of what's left in order to make that happen. Uh, But, I mean, not a disastrous night last night. As many people were predicting for Republicans, first of all, they've gained seats in the House. They were supposed to, Nancy Pelosi thought they were going to pick up, I don't know, was it 30? Hmm. Uh, Instead, I think the Republicans have picked up. They're plus four right now. Four, yeah. Hmm. That's what I thought it was, four. And in the Senate, they're going to hold the Senate. Republicans will hold the Senate, it looks like. Uh, That's almost a certainty now. Florida went to President Trump, thank goodness, because without it, he couldn't win. Texas, of course, went to the president because without it, he would have lost. And Texas, I mean, oh, Biden's might actually take Texas. It's razor thin. It's this close. Here comes the blue NAMI. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. The blue NAMI didn't happen. Uh, Trump won Texas by, was it five or six points? Five and a half, something like yeah, that? Yeah, 52 and a, mm, I don't know, 52, 47. Yeah, if it, no, it's about 52, 46 right now. That's oh, almost uh, six points. Yeah. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, and speaking of Florida, shouldn't it mean something to people that Cuban Americans yeah. uh, overwhelmingly <laughs> support Donald Trump? They've been through communism. They know what it looks like, and they avoid these Democrats like the plague. (laughs) That should be a bigger story. We should push that. We should push that narrative a little bit harder because these are the people who understand uh, the beginnings of it, the middle of it, the uh, horrifying continuation of it. They've seen all that, and that's why they're so dead set against Democrats in Florida. Still have a bunch of key key states pending, though. Yeah. Uh, tens of millions of votes still to count. I read something like 26 million. Hmm. I think that still have to be counted. Yeah. Uh, I think eight states are still outstanding. Hmm. No, Nevada's not going to give us any more val- uh, tallies until noon Eastern, they said. So okay. th- that's going to freeze in place right now. They haven't called Nevada yet? No, nah, it's forty nine. Four, it's 49.3 to 48.7. Biden leads there. Wow. That's really close. Um, Arizona thinks <clears throat> they will finish their tally later today. Well, tr- uh, Biden's kind of claiming mm-hmm. he won Arizona. Yeah, right now it looks like there's a distinct possibility that Arizona could go from Trump to Biden and Nevada could go from Biden to Trump or from Hillary to Trump. Um, hmm. that, well, that'd be a nice switch. I mean, yeah. if we have to lose Arizona, it'd be nice to get the other one back. Yeah, but you're trading uh, 11 yeah, for, for six. Yes. Yeah, Georgia great. expecting their tallies uh, later today. That's not looking good because Atlanta and absentee ballots are what are outstanding there. So right now in Georgia, it's uh, 50.5 to 48.3. Trump is leading, mm-hmm. but uh, 92% hmm. are reported. Um, so 8% of the vote left in mm-hmm. Georgia. Yeah, and like I said, it's in a hotbed Democratic uh, area. By the way, Lindsey Graham, who was in so much trouble. Oh, he was in huge trouble. He was on his way out. His opponent spent $104 million. <laughs> the most <laughs> of any Senate race of all time. Yeah. Surpassed the uh, the Beto race but at least it was a tight race, million. right yeah. really tight yeah very very close just razor thin 12 percentage points is what graham won that by so competitive. 12 points he crushed him mm-hmm. so that's funny. a lot of these narratives Lindsey graham's gonna lose texas is turning blue and none of that stuff happened thank heaven <clears throat> here's what uh, president trump said Late last night, or I guess early this morning. I want to thank the American people for their tremendous support. Millions and millions of people voted for us tonight. And uh, Mm -hmm. a very sad group of people is trying to disenfranchise that group of people. And we won't stand for it. We will not stand for it. And we were getting ready Mm -hmm. for a big celebration. 
we, we were winning everything, and all of a sudden, it was just called off. The results tonight have been phenomenal, and we are getting ready. I mean, literally, we were just all set to get outside and just celebrate something that was so beautiful, so good. <laughs> Uh, such a vote, such a success. So beautiful. The citizens so beautiful. of this country have so come tremendous. out in record numbers. This is a record. There's never been anything like it uh -huh. to support our incredible movement. They knew they couldn't win, so they said, let's go to court. And did I predict this, Newt? Did I say this? I've been saying this from the day I heard they were going to send out tens of millions of ballots. I said exactly because either they were going to win, or if they didn't win, they'll take us to court. This is a fraud on the American public. This is an embarrassment to our country. We were getting ready to win this election. Frankly, we did win this election. We did win this election. So our goal now is to ensure the integrity for the good of this nation, this is a very big moment. This is a major fraud in our nation. We want the law to be used in a proper manner. So we'll be going to the U.S. Supreme Court. Right. We want all voting to stop. We don't Wait, want what? them to find any ballots at 4 o'clock in the mm. morning and add them to the list, okay? <laughs> it's, it's a very sad... It's a very sad moment. To me, this is a very sad moment. And we will win this. And we, as far as I'm concerned, we already have won it. All right. Uh, I hope all that's true. I hope, I hope he already has won this. I hope he's got it. I hope he's going to finish it off. But, you know, maybe he inartfully put that by saying he wants all voting to stop. I, I know what he means. He doesn't want them finding fraudulent fraudulent ballots somewhere that all of a sudden oh we had this in my pants i had a whole bag full of wow biden votes i don't know how it got there but here a fun place for that it. was in your pants really yeah i don't uh, know i don't know how it got there sandy, i don't know sandy uh burglar yes. sandy, sandy, what was it yeah sandy burglar that's what we, <laughs> sandy burger 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 thank you mm -hmm. gosh yep yeah maybe that's where he puts his votes huh perhaps it's possible <laughs>